So here I have uh, my representation of the universe. So for everyday life, our universe is flat. We drive along the cars, we walk along the street, we have a flat universe. But then Einstein came along and he said, well, that's not quite true. The universe itself is actually like a fabric and everything which is in the universe creates that fabric to change its shape. And I have here, this is a, a dummy of a Lisa Pathfinder test mass. So this is 46 millimeters on a side. It's made of tungsten, not gold platinum, but it weighs about two kilograms. So if I use this to represent my black hole, and I put my black hole into my universe, immediately see that space changes, space warps around the black hole. And I now have my marble, this is my little planet, or my other black hole, and I let it go round. You start to see that it orbits, and it orbits quite slowly, then it gets faster and faster and faster. And just before it gets to the bottom, if we do it again, if we look at the, the black hole, you see the black hole starts to oscillate. And it's this oscillation which then creates the ripples in space which are coming out through the universe and these are the gravitational waves. And these are the things we're trying to measure with the future gravitational wave detectors of which Lisa Pathfinder is the first step.